Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today is a quick book chat about something I just finished, A Barrier Gaze by Chuck Tingle. This is the second, I believe, book that he has published, like a mainstream publishing. Um, we all know those, well, they're not KU available anymore, but like, uh, banged in the butt by my butt, that kind of story that he is infamous for. Uh, this is the second, like, mainly, you know, not indie book. So our main character, he is a screenwriter, has a lot of work out there, some award-winning, some not, a lot of horror-based stories, um, and he gets called into the office. He writes the show called The Travelers. I believe it's The Travelers. He talks about another show, too, so I could be getting the them mixed up but he has two ambiguous uh two main characters that have kind of an ambiguous sexuality but their relationship it's two females um is kind of leaning towards they are going to hook up but he gets told he needs to write it so they don't because that's what the big heads at this company want they don't want that relationship you either need to kill them off some you know end it somehow so he doesn't want to do that but they're like okay we'll think on it and if you decide to do what we say then we will keep using you if you don't basically basically you're ruined in this like nobody's gonna want to work with you so he goes has these other things he's doing on the side while he's thinking about it. And characters from his shows and movies start showing up and killing people. I ended up giving this three stars. I did not care for the direction that it went into. I guess it, it gave an explanation. You get an explanation, but I didn't care for the explanation, if that makes any sense. It throw there's an aspect thrown in here that I don't care for personally, but it probably worked for a lot of other people. Um, will I give this author another chance? Yes, I did read another book by him. I think or it was a novella called Street, and that was just okay for me. The other one I I'm gonna try sometime. I don't know when. As Camp Damascus, I haven't, I think I tried that a long time ago, but it was on audio, so I'm going to try it in physical form. But I ended up giving Barrier Gaze three stars, and we'll try the author again. It is fun. It is fast. Well, hmm. you get a mixture of current happenings, also with a, not a timeline, but like, little vignettes of his history that give you an idea of where he came up with the characters that are currently going after people in present time, which I did appreciate that. I really liked that. It made sense why he based his real life horrors. Um, well, he used his real life horrors as a basis for characters and his, um, stories that he wrote so i did like that a lot i am interested to see how camp damascus is in comparison i know it's a completely different story but i'm wondering if this certain aspect will show up in that but it was cool to see camp damascus mentioned in here um that's all i got for this have you read this do you plan to i do love this cover beautiful um, leave a comment down below, like, even sub if you're not subbed yet. But that is it for this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.